Hey there, everybody. Pete Pardo here from Sea of Tranquility. Welcome to What's Hot with Sea of Tranquility. This is the show we do each and every Wednesday here on the channel. We do multiple episodes reviewing all sorts of new releases that come out in the uh, all the genres that we cover. Hard rock, metal, classic rock, progressive rock, jazz, fusion. That's what we do here on the channel. Today, for this episode, we're going to take a look at a great new double album that just came out, hot off the presses, from one of the most respected jazz fusion bands of all time from, and the leader of the band he's no longer with us but and he's greatly missed but one of the great visionaries of all time this is the Chick Corea electric band the future is now two disc set it's essentially kind of like on vinyl terms it's pretty much a triple album right so this is uh, the last live recordings well we may see others right but this is was being put together while Chick was still with us before he left us a couple years ago. And this is comprised of recordings taken from the uh, 2016, 2017, 2018 shows that the band had done, mostly from taken from Catalina's in Los Angeles, California, but you also have some, you have one track from the Blue Note in, in uh, New York, the Blue Note in Tokyo, and uh, Sonoma out in California as well. So, but the majority of it is uh, from the cat from Catalina's in Los Angeles. So let's take a look here. Very cool cover. Here you got what they looked like on the tour, right? And what they originally looked like back in the mid '80s, right? <clears throat> of course, you've got Eric Marienthal on saxophone, Chick Corea on all sorts of keyboards, John Patitucci on bass. Dave Weckl on drums, and Frank Gambale on guitars. Let's take a look here. Cool live shots there. Got the two CDs on either side, and in the middle, you've got additional live photos in the booklet. Very, very cool stuff. And then what's really interesting, so that, like I said, this was already being put together uh, starting in 2020 uh, by, by Chick and the band before Chick passed away a year later, I guess it was. And um, it's got all sorts of commentary from the guys while Chick was still around talking about the history of the band and the tour and the albums and things like that. So you got all, all members here chiming in when they first joined the band. The ups and downs, the great music, the, the tours, and specifically this last tour, right? And then Chick himself talking about all the different tracks on the album that are included, which represent songs from most of the albums that they put out, right? So we've got, uh, let's see, Charge Particles kicks it off. Incredible. What a way to open up a, a uh, live album. Charged Particles, just absolutely incredible. Uh, you do have, uh, there are three tracks on this album from the very, very last Chick Corea Electric Band album, which actually came out in the many, many years ago, right? But they hadn't released a new studio album in quite a bit. And then you've got uh, other assorted tracks from throughout their, their history. So all told, you get uh, nine songs in, in total. But each one of them are really, really lengthy, so it's a lot of room to stretch out in classic fusion uh, way, right? Charge Particles kicks it off, then you got Trance Dance, CTA, Jocelyn the Commander, and Beneath the Mask make up uh, disc one. Uh, I would say certainly Charge Particles is red hot. It might be my favorite track on this album. It's just absolutely incredible. I mean, the musicianship between these five guys, the, the the synergy, the telepathy that goes between them is just off the charts good. Um, Trance Dance is lots of fun. CTA is great. I love the title track to Beneath the Mast. Then you got Jocelyn, which is uh, one of, the, like I said, one of the three albums from the most recent album from the band. Then over on disc two, you got uh, Ished, kicks it off. Alan Corday, another new one, or newish one, most recent one, uh, Johnny's Landing, which is really good. And of course, their kind of staple song from the very, very first Chicory Electric Band album, Gotta Match. Just amazing. Absolutely amazing. And it's really long. I think it's like 18 minutes long. And the band go off into all sorts of solos and things and incredible 
weaving this, that, and the other thing. Intense. Just really, really great. In fact, for me, I think the two bookends on the album, Charged Particles and Gotta Match, first and last track, uh, perfect way to open, perfect way to end. Everything else in between is just all the, the good stuff in between. But man, those the, the, the bread on the sandwich here is some of the most amazing bread you'll ever have in your life. So yeah, this is amazing. Five out of five star. It sounds spectacular too. Uh, literally, it sounds like one you know one spectacularly recorded concert at one place, but it actually is taken from various locations, various nights, and things like that. But uh, you couldn't tell. Great sounding audio recording here. Splendid stuff. The playing is off the charts, and it's like you listen to this and you. It just reminds you of like how great this band was and how amazing Chick was and how much we miss him. And it's just sad that we won't get any more Chick Corea electric band or Chick Corea music in general. Sad. But uh, as a great tribute to Chick and this amazing band, this is a wonderful live album. So if you are at all remotely interested in fusion music, mandatory purchase. The Future is now the Chick Corea electric band double live album or double live CD, I should say. Um, final versions i'm sure might be might be triple possibly because like i said this is a uh, pretty long a lot of music here a lot of music here but uh well worth checking out so if you've already heard it let us know what you think down in the comments below if not go check it out come back and report in and visit us on the web at www.seatranquility.org we're on facebook we're on youtube all together all the damn time please subscribe if you haven't already and click on that notification bell so you get alert of all of our content as it posts and please do hit the like button before you leave also down below we got the links to our ko-fi page for channel donations our merch page and our cameo page so thanks in advance for all your support there and we'll see you soon here with more album reviews coming up at you in just a little bit until then i'm p pardo thanks for watching everybody Bye bye